What's up guys? Today I'm going to be talking to you about some of the different oils that we carry, their viscosities, and the difference between a conventional synthetic blend and fully synthetic oil. These are two of the common oils that we sell here, one being a synthetic blend and the other being a fully synthetic oil. First we're going to be talking about the viscosity of these oils, or the thickness. Here we have a 10W40. The 10W refers to the winter or cold weather viscosity, which is present at startup. The 40 refers to its operational viscosity. This chart shows the optimal operating temperature for each of these oils. As you can see, the SAE30, which is a monograde or individual weighted oil, operates at the same temperature as its 10W30 counterpart. The only difference between these two oils is the 10W30's winter viscosity, making the SAE30 a cheaper alternative for warmer climates. Next, we're going to be talking about the difference between a conventional oil and a synthetic oil. Oil makes up about 50% of an engine's cooling capability. The difference in these oils lies in its consistency. As you can see, the molecules in conventional oils are all different. Synthetic oils are manufactured with consistency, which helps viscosity control. For instance, the change between 10 weight and 30 weight, and are more resistant to breaking down, giving the oil a longer lifespan. Synthetic blends, like this Kawasaki oil, use elements of both conventional and synthetic oils to create a mid-range for performance and price. I hope this video helped clarify some of the common questions that we get. For more information, please visit us in-store or online at arlingtonpower.com. Thank you for watching.